Hi there and Happy New Year. Today is January 1st, 2022 and I am doing my first video journal of the year. So it's a new year and I don't want to say I have resolutions because I'm all about continuous improvement and with continuous improvement you look back and say, you know, what are the things that you were doing last year? Like, what was your goal, uh, your overarching goal? You know, what are the things that you were doing? What are the things that were working really well? What, what do you want to continue to do? What are the things that you want to stop doing? What are the things that you need to start? So um, last year, I had a couple of goals. My main most important goal was to get through 2021 without any mental health issues. And so I was very um, intentional about the types of things that I was going to do, the mindset that I was going to have, um, and what I was going to carry into each and every day so that I could be at peace and be content, um, not to be anxious, not to be worrisome. Um, so yeah, so I happy that I got through 2021. I overcame what I saw as a, a hurdle that I needed to get over um, because I needed to get past this eight year hurdle where, you know, my cycle for mental health issues had been eight years. And so I'm happy to say that I conquered that. I did it, you know, I, I set out, I knew that I could. Um, and I was very intentional about waking up every morning, you know, with gratitude and saying my prayers and thanking God, you know, for all that's good in my life. Um, I was very intentional about exercising, you know, doing yoga just about every day, you know, incorporating other things in. Um, what I wasn't so good at, because I also wanted to drop some of this weight that I had gained, you know, um, several years ago, I lost a lot of weight. Um, I started at 280 pounds and I got down to about 140 pounds. And I really would have liked to have maintained that weight, but I didn't, you know, I ended up putting like another 40 pounds on. Um, so I really, was trying to, you know, change, you know, my diet, what it is that I was eating and how I was exercising and all those things in hopes that I would um, be able to shed those pounds. And I didn't, um, you know, I was very successful in what I needed to do just to keep peace of mind. But what I didn't do very well, um, is get a hold of what I'm going to call, you know, my unhealthy relationship with food and being an emotional eater. You know, if I was, you know, something was bothering me, I might try not to worry about it. And I may not even actively worry about it, but I would snack on things and, you know, eat things that I shouldn't eat or just eat more often than I should eat. Not eating when I'm hungry, but just eating to eat, you know, because it's just a bad habit. And so um, that's the big thing that I would like to conquer this year. I would like to have a healthy relationship with food and I would like to have good eating habits. Um, I would like to be 140 pounds. You know, right now I, I got on the scale this morning and I think I weighed 176 pounds. Um, so yeah, I just want to claim 140. And I want to, you know, when I think about what I don't want to do, I don't want to eat before 10 a.m. in the morning. And I don't want to eat after seven o'clock at night. Um, I want to, you know, eat balanced meals and I want not to eat the things that are just automatically going to put weight on, you know, like 
processed foods. Um, not to say that I'm never going to eat any processed foods, but I'm going to try to stay away from bread and pasta and rice. Um, and I think that that will probably help me. So those are some of the things that I'm going to try not to do. I wrote myself a little bit of a list. Um, things that I want to do a little bit differently than last year. I mean, yeah, I had said, I started off the year saying that I was going to do these video journals every single day. Well, I found that I don't have anything to, I don't have enough to talk about every single day. So I'm going to modify that and say, let me do it maybe once, once a week. Um, and in that include things like doing a, you know, a weekly weigh in just to say where I am. Um, and to do that with the video journal, I am going to incorporate weight training, you know, all this year, everything that I did, I did at home and it was mostly, um, yoga or running on the treadmill, something like that. But I wasn't really every once in a while I might do some weights, but I think I'm going to try and go to the gym two to three times a week and to do days where I do, you know, upper body or, you know, arms another day when I'm doing legs or whatever, but I'm going to try to be consistent on a weekly basis to do, um, to do weight training in the gym. Um, I'm also going to periodically do yoga classes in real live yoga classes as opposed to just doing them on YouTube. I did, I started off good today. I got up this morning, I went to a 7.30 yoga class. It was 7.30 to nine. And then um, I did, I got on the treadmill. I walked a mile, I ran a mile. Uh, and then I did another mile walking, but you know, doing an incline walking. Then I went and I did weights, I did legs, um, and I got on the bike and I did three miles. So another thing that I'm planning to do, I did not do in 2021, I did it in 2020, this thing called um, Run the Year. So it's Run the Year 2022. And what you try to do is, I'm gonna say I'm gonna travel. I'm not necessarily gonna run all of this, but um, by the end of 2022, I want to have done 2022 miles where I'm either walking or running or riding on the bike. So that's basically doing um, not quite six miles a day. So I did do, um, like I said, I did three miles on the treadmill today and then I did three and a quarter miles on the bike um, today at the gym. So I'm starting off, I'm starting off strong. Uh, what else do I want to do? I think that those are the things, those are my goals for this year. So, um, 140 pounds is where I want to be. Um, I also, I want to continue with yoga and I did a new kind of yoga today. It's, I don't know what it's called. I forget. It's Ash. I don't know what it is. Some kind of new yoga that I hadn't done before. And um, I did it for an hour and a half. And there were all these new binds that I hadn't done before. And some of them were like, how the heck do you get your body to do that? And so I'm going to try to master some of those binds. So I want to advance my yoga skills. Uh, which is going, and I think in order to, to be able to do the things that I want to be able to do, I think I need to lose this weight. And, um, uh, yeah, I just need to be challenging myself. So, um, so three goals, one, to weigh 140 pounds, two, to master new yoga binds, and three, to have a healthy relationship with food. Uh, so those are the three new ones. 
I want to stay true to everything that I did in 2021 in terms of just being intentional about how I live my life, focusing on positivity and gratitude, you know, kind of taking things one day at a time and being content with life and being accepting of what it is that, that life brings my way. Um, and so, um, yeah, I just want to continue with that as well. So that's my, that's my plan for 2022. And again, I will, uh, I'll check in periodically, but that's that. Take care.